trust your religions, but trust Jesus Christ instead. Sir, do you want to go to heaven when you die? Amen. Well, if you want to go to heaven, put your faith on Jesus Christ. That's all God requires of you. You know, when the Apostle Paul was in jail, the jailer asked Paul, what must I do to be saved? Have you ever wondered that? What must I do to be saved? And the Apostle Paul simply said one thing, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and you will be saved. The Apostle Paul did not say, join a religion. The Apostle Paul did not say, become a religious person. The Apostle Paul did not say, follow all these religious rules no the apostle paul simply said one thing he said believe on the lord jesus christ and you will be saved put your faith entirely on jesus christ jesus was at was after the same he was asked the same kind of question by the jewish religious leaders Every day when we come out here, we hear the sirens, the ambulances, and I hope it's a stark warning to everyone here that you're not promised tomorrow. You're not promised one more day. The person inside the ambulance did not expect to be there today. Sometimes death comes suddenly, unexpectedly, and that's why this message I have for you today is urgent. The Bible says today is the day of salvation. Today is the day. If you've been putting this off your whole life, don't put it off another day. Don't put it off another moment. When the Jewish religious leaders asked Jesus, what work does God require us to do? He simply said, believe on me. Believe on Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ did not tell them, you've got to be uh, join a religion. Jesus did not say, you've got to be baptized under water Jesus did not say you've got to light candles confess to a priest worship a pope no Jesus simply said one thing believe on him that's all God requires of you can you do it can you put your faith on Jesus Christ